Hi there, this is Dan from Finbullet.com uh, This time in this video I'm going to show you how to add a gallery page uh, basically galleries to your um, blog or website uh, run on casual blog uh, WordPress theme So let's go to dashboards Once you log into the dashboard well, the first thing you need to do you need to add new page uh, the page that will be um, this page will be your gallery page so I will call it uh, image gallery just just nothing sophisticated really and from the page attributes on, on the right side uh, you need to select templates and template will be set I will set it to four columns uh, um, let's you have the option to choose two columns, three columns or four columns. Th this is going to be a main gallery view where you have all your uh, gallery posts listed. So it's not going to be single post, single gallery post, ju just, just to let you know. And here, um, basically, that's it. Uh, we're done here. Uh, now, once you do that, uh, we need to create menu link to the to this page to be visible for your users so from the pages it will, sh will show up in your pages um, tab and done um, uh, yes and we have image gallery if we go to our front end view we'll see sorry I didn't save so you need to remember about saving that first and then you have we have image gallery link. Obviously, this won't show anything uh, until we add some galleries to it. Uh, to add galleries, we're using custom post galleries. So on your left side, uh, and there's a gallery, or it might be called portfolio in our um, other themes. And then uh, let's add some categories first. Um, Basically, I've got some categories added here already. Uh, all right. <coughs> and um, yeah, let's say category three. Okay, it's not refreshing for some reason for me. Uh, um, I've updated for uh, to. To WordPress version 4.1, and since then I have got this issue. I didn't check what's happening there, but uh, it's just enough to refresh page, and everything seems to be fine. Okay, and then add new galleries. To add new gallery posts, we need to click on uh, Add New, and then um, let's call it Single Gallery Posts, uh, Single Image Gallery Post. Um, there are a couple of formats available for you to choose from. There's one, uh, one is called image, slideshow, grid gallery, video, and audio. Obviously, image will be single image, and then you need to add featured image. You need to upload it, select. Yeah, let's add this page. It's important um, to to upload those images to the posts. And set featured image and then uh, here uh, if you notice that the, your image is not uh, opening up in lightbox you need to make sure that you enable the lightbox here so select yes and let's assign it to category one it's at sample tags so single image portfolio gallery Post. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> um, okay. <coughs> Once we publish, we can refresh our image gallery or just click on it. And as you notice, it will show up. The image here. Alright. So. Obviously, or you can change the, the layout later on. So if you're not happy with the width of it, you might think that the image is too small and you don't really need four columns uh, uh, here. So you can go to pages, all pages, and 
then edit your image gallery page and set it to let's say three columns oh three columns yes okay update so images will be bigger and uh, this main page this image gallery it will show you uh, well, will be shown as a masonry uh, or ma kind of tiled mosaic style uh, so um, it's good to know um, all right I will add more pages um, um, I will add more uh, gallery posts to our gallery all right just gallery with actually create And let's select as a format grid gallery. Uh, we need to set featured image. This will be shown as thumbnail. No, no, I don't like this one. All right, um, let's set this one. Fair enough. And um, here, there's a slightly things are getting slightly different. Basically, we need to add. Uh, uh, our photos images as um, uh, via add media button and upload files we need to upload them physically to to the posts so let's add a couple of the images There's no need to insert them into the page, but if you do that, basically, if you do that, you can delete them from here, really. But uh, because they already attached, they need to. Only important thing is uh, that they need to be attached to this particular post. So publish. As you can see we have more and difference between single image this is single image and there is no uh, navigation arrows and grid gallery here in this view is that it's not showing up the other uploaded images so this is the difference and obviously uh, the, the most important thing is uh, you can link to this grid um, uh, grid gallery uh, post uh, separately to show it just uh, as a grid view I will show you how to do that in a minute uh, let's add a uh, couple of more uh, galleries first because uh, we clearly missing something so it's not as pretty as it uh, as it could be All right let's say gallery three Select slideshow and so slideshow. So, and again, um, we need to set up um, a featured image. So this can be chosen, let's say, from here. Um, and then we need to add upload media to the posts. Uh, to the posts to um, let's say. there's no need to insert that into the page uh, because the, the, my slide the slideshow is created automatically so once we publish it uh, okay publish and we have slideshow right 
obviously the, this is not showing uh, a slideshow now you can't see you can't tell the difference I'm going to do um, uh, direct links to the to do those um, uh, gallery posts now so to do that um, to link them uh, link those pages directly those posts directly we need to go to uh, appearance menus and then um, from the screen options you need to make sure you've got gallery checked this will trigger uh, this will show you up the, the galleries um, uh, posts so let's say <coughs> let's add grid view and gallery All right. All right, let's call it created menu link as you can see it's loading the, the grid view the only thing is we didn't uh, check lightbox so it's not show um, uh, you can't um, view bigger images so uh, if you don't do that basically you can always come back uh, to the gallery to particular posts and edit that scroll down and enable lightbox set it to yes update as you can see oh, sorry just my software all right create gallery all right as you can see there's an image now and you can see the images in the lightbox okay uh, let's create more links so go back to appearance menus and let's create direct link to the uh, gallery free uh, if I remember correctly it was uh, slider so sli slideshow it's called slideshow save menu and we go to slideshow yes and now we have slideshow as you can see it's adjusting automatically obviously the, you need to remember to crop the images if you want to look them good <laughs> if you want them to look good in, uh, in slideshow uh, it will adjust anyway and uh, okay and uh, single image let's create another single image was was the first uh, gallery post we created single image save okay and now yes so <coughs> you have a choice you can uh, link to uh, let's say create ni a nice mosaic and add some filterable options here or you can even link to uh, particular sub galleries so there's uh, no limit really for you and uh, you can always yeah you can create nice subfolders and organize your photos um, efficiently really um, okay, thank you for watching. I, I hope it was uh, useful for you and uh, see you next time.